。我是乔治，我现在在二零零七年在中国，这是我的小的价值场。如果一个病人来，我非常喜欢给他一个很舒服的感觉，所以我。开始做一个小的小的园在里面，夏天是都是非常多燕子，然后非常舒服，所以我觉得这个是很重要。因为那个病人他们刚手术的时候，他们的心真的不好，我觉得我们必须要给他那个回来他的以前的感觉。The reason for amputation here in Wuze is mainly accidents, car accidents, working accidents. Um, and then right now they're coming more and more uh, diabetic. Or cancer, um, smoking, blood circulation issues. Um, these are the normal reasons for an amputation. It is a huge event in your life if you have to face an amputation. It will bring as well additional challenges to you, but this is not the end. You just have to communicate with your technician uh, what do you want, and then we need to think about a good solution. Don't put all the questions in yourself and don't communicate it. There is no questions is a bad question. Yeah, so with every, every answer, you will learn something additional. This is all not very even. In the field, it is all easy. This is very easy. But in the field, I have to give him a challenge. Because in the outside, in the village, in the country, it is all not very even. So we have to give him this explanation of how to do it. So the patient can try it. 怎么怎么用那个夹子？一周以后，他们走路在那个平房不需要那个扶呃扶嗯扶手。我们给他培训 ，OK， 先生，上坡或者下坡怎么走？如果一个新的病，我们可以查一下那个他的腿是多大。完了，我们必须要考虑一下 ，OK， 那个肌肉你不用那个肌肉，那么越来越小，必须要。Um, adjust to the Chief Jiang. I was, when I came to China in 2007, I was attending the, the Paralympic Games in Beijing, 2008. Then 2012, I went to London. And uh, 2016, I went to Rio de Janeiro. So these three games I attended and it was always a highlight of the year. They overcame their disability and uh, they would like to compete and show what they're able to do as well to be an example for somebody who just lost a leg. I think it's important to show these normal amputees what you finally can do. I think when you look at these athletes, how they're running, how they're acting, how they make the sport, then you will see this is just an additional tool what you have on your body. Just get up, stand up. Life is not over with the procedures. You can do it. I was working a long time right now, 15 or more years in China. I see how patients are treated. What is the end result of the procedures? Um, if they are comfortable, if they are really taken care of. So that's why I built up my own studio with a much more family-like and comfortable environment that the patients, they, they need to have a kind of a, a hold in this difficult situation. And I would like to help the people. I see a lot of people who are hidden somewhere because they don't have a comfortable procedures. My aim is really to try to give as many people as possible a good quality procedures and that they are coming back into their family, back into their life, back into work. Thank you.